Okay, we're going to be filling a uh, 50 liter Dewar we're borrowing from MWI. And um, one of the first things you need to do is connect the two lines, stainless lines right here at the coupling. It doesn't fill uh, like the other smaller doers where you can uh, just pour it in off the liquid valve. We have a vent and a fill valve. We also have a liquid level and pressure. And one of the first things you want to do, just to keep the pressure going, uh, this is similar to the way we fill it down at uh, Caltech. Uh, we'll open this uh, fill valve and open these two valves all the way. And it, you'll see it uh, fill up here on the liquid level. And when it begins to spurt out uh, some snow here, it's completely. So we're filling our 50 liter doer of Allen 2. We have the vent open, our liquid valve open, our liquid valve open coming from our 160 liter doer. And our vent over here is closed. Keep that closed. We can only use this doer with this adapter set here. We can't use our other doer. We don't have the right fitting. When this uh, is full, it will register on the uh, gauger and also begin to spurt out Allen 2 out of the vent on this side. All right then, we're uh, beginning to get some uh, Allen 2 coming out of our vent. We're full, pressure's a little down. We'll turn off the vent first. Yeah, that's good. Building up a little bit of pressure. We'll turn off the fill valve, the liquid valve. Turn off this liquid valve on the main doer. Here is I've released, uh, since we don't have a pressure relief valve, I've opened up our little connection here off the fill, off the liquid valve, to release the pressure in the line. Uh, normally we would have a, uh, a little T-valve in here, which we would need to put in. It would work out and would help us out quite a bit. And now we have a full doer. Pressure should be building up pretty quick here. Ready to go. Thank you.